Hello YouTube, Jar of Bricks here with another update. I've been building a few sets the last week or so as we come about and look at Ninjago City Gardens. Wow, that was a great set. And you know that I have a rule in my city that I don't have any official sets. I only have mocks. Well, this set is probably my all time favorite set. Uh, just for variation, just for the technical bits that were um, put into creating it. And it was just a really enjoyable build. Previously, my favorite one was the um, Parisian restaurant, purely because that set got me into the rabbit hole of building a Lego city. So, that being said i am going to keep that a little bit longer than i typically would i will get rid of it eventually but for now i'm going to keep it and i'm going to keep it in chinatown so this is all going to have to be readdressed the shops are too close to the curb there and uh, i'm going to i'm going to attempt to raise the plates for the pavements as well uh, so hopefully that'll look good i don't know how i'm going to do it yet i'm thinking about getting rid of the water right the way around city gardens just to see if that will help at the moment they are pretty close to the track but i've had the train going around and it's not been affected by it so we'll see so as you can see it's quite close to the track but the train isn't hitting it so that's okay I'm going to uh, probably keep the water gardens at the back. Uh, just get rid of the water around the front and sides. Uh, there is a gap there and that's just because of the bits overhanging from the various buildings. But that's okay, I will fix that. What a build this is. My favorite build, really enjoyed it. So um, panning around the city now to what I completed last week, the back cave. If you want to see that in more detail, uh, check out the video from last week. So with that in mind, Wayne Manor is ready to start being built there. Just waiting on a few bits to start that. And then going over, I also built the police station that was a really nice build but to be honest after building city gardens it just wasn't quite as good it was it was good of course but um, i've just been built city gardens first so wasn't disappointed it was still a great build but city gardens was just better so i built a second police station so that is on its way i built it was almost free thanks to vip points and um, I'm going to be dismantling that. That way I can make uh, a bigger donut shop and the, what's the newspaper? It's not really anything, that green building that is pretending to be a separate building but it actually isn't. Um, I can make something out of that having two sets. And then I can build in line with the Batman theme, a GCPD, uh, which is going to be located there. And that is pretty much next things on the list uh, one thing else I am planning on doing is getting rid of that 16 by 16 base plate and that 16 by 32 sorry base plate just so that these buildings can be pushed together creating more space here and then that road will be moved 16 studs over there which will make this area a lot wider so I can put a few buildings uh, along there so that is something I'm going to do after I've built the police station and after I've fixed Chinatown and after I've built Wayne Manor that's it with this update so if you like the update give us a thumbs up if you haven't already please subscribe and uh, if you have any suggestions as how to improve the city, please feel free to give them as it really does help 
the channel and more importantly my city out so thank you for everything and i will see you again soon goodbye